Joining us now is Dr. Charles Sophie. He is a member of the Dr. Phil Advisory Board. He's board certified in three clinical specialties, adult psychiatry and child and adolescent psychiatry, as well as family practice, and as well as being the medical director for the Department of Child and Family Services here in Los Angeles, which is the largest agency in the country. He works a lot with children there and also uh, privately. So I've asked him to join us and weigh in. I have an advisory board. It's made up of the top minds in psychiatry, psychology, sociology, medicine, uh, all the different disciplines. And I have the ability, a lot of these are editors of the peer review journals. Uh, I have the ability to send out different cases that I have and, and get feedback from them, which is a great resource to me. Dr. Sophie is one of those people. So Dr. Sophie, thank you for thank being you. here. Welcome. Thank you. I'm glad you're here. You. Um, now, you know, I, I was asking you a, a, mm -hmm. about this video. Yes. I asked you if you thought it was reasonable to be asking this child this question. All the questions that were there I said, I don't know if he has childhood schizophrenia or if he is on the autism spectrum. I mm -hmm. suspect it's one of the two, although it would be in, inappropriate for me to render a diagnosis without doing the workup that you mm -hmm. wish you would get done by, yes, by yes. someone and I'm appropriately. Uh, but I can tell you that those things would be on my short list of considerations. I can tell you whichever it is, the way in which you're managing it, in my opinion, is inappropriate based on what I am seeing on those videos that is not in the child's best interest. But you've, you and I have been talking about this for a number of days. What's your take on this? Well, my take about this is not necessarily about your child. It's about the two of you being selfish. And your child... <laughs> honestly. Both of your kids are drowning in all of this crazy drama that you do. I know you're angry at him because he left. He abandoned them. He ought to own that. But the bottom line is he'll never get diagnosed properly because there's too much noise around him. But he wasn't diagnosed properly before all of this well, noise. But the point is he's not going to get what he needs. Well, when is he? Can you provide that help? I can, I, he'll get the help when you two knock your stuff off. Well, you okay, but no, we need, we need a good doctor, have, though. Okay, you are the perfect person to do this. You are the perfect person to do this as well. You have all the resources. I'm fine. I want you to help But you need to, to step us. out. You need to let I a doctor do, do But, but, a but doctor no, not a to, doctor. Somebody a doctor that you guys know. has to do their know. job. Yes, and they're not. But they can't when you're in their face. <laughs> and, and I, well, I, he, put, hey, he put the doctor's name on the internet. I do understand that you're coming from a good place, probably on behalf of your kid, but you have to understand, you're in their so face. Well. Hang on, you're in their face though. And that's gonna really make a doctor step back. 